How do you get to school? Do you ride a bicycle? Or ride in a car? These vehicles use wheels, which are in the shape of a circle. Many natural and human objects are circle shaped. A circle is a geometric figure with several special properties. Two basic dimensions of a circle are its circumference and its diameter. Whatever the size of the circle, these two quantities always have the same ratio. If you divide the circumference by the diameter, you get a ratio of about 3.14 to 1, which is the famous number pi. Pi is always an approximate value because the actual value cannot be computed. For example, a circle with a diameter of one unit has an approximate circumference of 3.14159, etc. The decimals just keep going. What this means in practice is that you can never compute the exact circumference of the circle from its diameter. Compared with other geometric figures, a circle encloses the smallest area for a given diameter. You can see this because all points from the center of the circle are an equal distance from the circumference. No other two-dimensional shape has this property. The radius of a circle is half its diameter. The radius is useful to compute other dimensions of the circle. For example, a circle's area is pi times the square of the radius, or pi r squared. Technically, a circle is just the line that forms the round shape, so the area is actually the area enclosed by the circle. The radius is also used to measure a fraction of the circle, called a sector. A sector is made of two radii that meet at the center and intersect with the circumference. For example, a dartboard pattern is made of 20 sectors. An angle of one degree is a 360th of a circle, so a circle has 360 sectors with an angle of one degree. Each piece of a pizza sliced into four is a sector. Each pizza slice has a 90 degree angle at the circle center. A chord is a line that touches any two points on a circle circumference. A chord that intersects the circle's center bisects the circle, forming two semicircles. A chord creates a circle segment. The arches of this bridge are circle segments. A circle is related to three-dimensional objects. Any section of a sphere is a circle. When you cut a spherical orange into slices, each slice is the shape of a circle. The horizontal cross-section that slices across a cone forms a circle. A cross-section across a cylinder is also circular. The circle provides ways to measure the surface area and volume of three-dimensional geometric objects. For example, the volume of a cylinder is its height times the area of its circular cross-section. You can easily draw a circle with a compass and pencil. Circles are one of the basic geometric objects that are useful in everyday life. A potter's wheel is used to make a plate in the shape of a circle. Coins are usually circle-shaped. Can you think of other examples of circles?